All right, guys, here's going to be a real quick video on how to get your beetle colony started. Um, you start off with a 500, 1,000, or 5,000. You're going to come in a small container. So I get a lot of questions about, I have a big enclosure. What do I do with them? So here's what I recommend. Here's my big enclosure that I already have cut up. What I have is two containers right here. I have a real small one small little shoebox Sterilite container and then the next size up. So what I recommend is that when you get your beetles you initially start in the smallest container. This allows them to eat and reproduce. They focus, they stay in a small tight area and doesn't allow them to wander away. When this container gets full you then transfer them over into this container. What I have right here also is what I recommend feeding them. Small little boneless scraps of meat. You want to feed them boneless stuff because if you feed them a skull the beetles have a tendency to lay their eggs on the skull. You're going to take the skull out and what that's going to do is going to take the potential or future eggs that are on there and you're going to take them out of the colony. So initially you want to leave all the eggs, do everything you can to keep that colony and let it grow. So what I have is different sizes. This is what you should start out with. Something real small, maybe the size of a little bit of a quarter. And then in a couple weeks you'll end up getting to a little piece like this. And that's when you know your, your beetles are really starting to rock and roll. So I'll show you real quick inside. I have some set. What I have is the inside of my container. And since they're so small, they're starter colonies, I kept them in the little shoe boxes. Instead of putting them in this big area, they won't have time to find each other, it'll take forever. So you put them in these condensed little uh, containers and what that allows them to do is focus on eating and reproducing. You can see all that there is is some shredded paper, some styrofoam to them to burrow in, and then I have those little chunks of meat. You put in one of those little chunks of meat, one a day, and when they start, whatever, they start consuming it, and it, the shorter time it takes, it might take them two hours, three hours, you put in another piece until you start getting to the big pieces. Then once your colony gets grown, you put them into the next size container like we showed earlier. You can then transfer them into this whole bottom size of the chest freezer and let them just multiply and now you have a big colony going. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. Give me a shout. You guys need any beetles? We do sell beetles. There's a link below. And uh, we also sell these nice little skull hangers, and that link is below as well. Send us a question if you have one. Thank you.